zero or a five. Yeah. Right? <laughs> okay, so look at look at this problem. It's eight by twenty it, it's eight plus twenty five, right? That's easy. What? Okay, I well, <laughs> what is it then? Twenty five plus eight. It's 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 what am I doing? Well, we can do it the way that we just practiced all those other problems. So draw the line, right? And if there's nothing in the 10 side, then we hold it with what? What do we use? We use zero. Right. So over here, we get 8 plus 5 is? 5. Eight. 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 Thirteen. Okay, mm -hmm. so you write down thirteen, right? What do you put in the ones spot? And then you've got how many groups of ten? One. One, so you add it over to your groups of ten, and then you get one plus two is? Three. Right, so three groups of ten. So now your answer of 25 plus 8 is 33, right? Okay, but there's another way you can do it. Because if you think about it in terms of groups of, ten, of 5, right, there's a way to, like, play with numbers to make it a little bit easier to add. So if you look over here, right, I know that you did the number pairs last year, yeah. right? Yeah. Is there a 5 anywhere in here? This is the last one, I promise. Can you just, I'm just trying to explain something to Annie Barb and she'll hear it better if she watches you. So, eight has four number pairs, right? Mm -hmm. It's got one and seven, two and six, three and five, and four and four. Are there any of these numbers that have a five in it? These yes. sets of numbers, which yeah. one? So, this one right here, right? Mm -hmm. So if you see the 8 and you see that this is a 5, right, what's 25 plus another 5? 30. Right? And then you've gotten rid of 5 of the 8, so what's left? 3. What's this problem? 33. Is that easier to add? Yeah. Because if you think about numbers in terms of their groups of 5... Mm -hmm. Then all you have to think about is what's left over, right? So if you see a, a if you see one of the numbers has a five in it, like let's do one more, okay? You see one of the numbers has a five in it, like forty-five plus uh, seven. Why do you keep me? Well, forty-five plus seven, right? Yep. What's Five plus what equals seven? Five plus two. Okay, so if you had to guess, right, you've got five. What this really is is 45 equals 45 plus five plus two, right? Yeah. So if you think about it that way, you can group these together. And what do you get here? 45 plus five is? But five is, of course, 50. Right. So you get 50, and then plus 2 is? Plus. Wait, so 50 plus 2 is 52. 52, right? So you're able to do 5 plus 7 is? 5. 